WLKY Weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. Pretty nice weather out there right now in this Monday late afternoon. It's breezy, it's warm, the humidity continues to ramp up. You can just kind of feel that there is a storm system on the way. Yeah, it's going to be here later on this evening with extremely high chances for rain and even a few storms. Question is, will those storms turn severe? There is that possibility right now, especially the farther west you go from Interstate 65. But right now, all is quiet. Beautiful live look from the Bristol restaurant back towards downtown Louisville, the Ohio River, and partly to mostly cloudy skies. But keep in mind, a tornado watch has been posted again from I-65 and points off to the west until 1 o'clock in the morning. It does include places like Louisville, Shepherdsville, down to E Town, Hodgenville, and again, areas off to the west. Right now, the good news don't have to worry about any rainfall whatsoever. I think we'll stay rain free for the next three to four hours. It's after 9, 10 o'clock, we'll start to see some showers and storms advancing from the west and southwest. The viewing area, clear at this time, but there's the main line now. Southern Illinois, just east of Paducah, down into western Tennessee, as well as Mississippi. Big line of showers and storms, packing a punch. We have tornado watches in effect along and east of that line up until about Interstate 65. That's where we still have lots of wind energy going on just ahead of this big storm system developing. You can see the curly cue, the comma shaped appearance to all the rain and storms. That signifies we have a big system now developing, a lot of jet stream, jet stream energy that is plunging down on the south side of this thing, lifting the air in place, lifting all that moisture. The end result, widespread showers and also storms. There's the storm system itself, the low pressure area now in northern Missouri, trailing from that a couple of boundaries as this entire system moves off to the east northeast and combines with that jet stream energy. There will be chances for not only heavy rainfall, but some gusty winds with any stronger cells and perhaps even a couple of weak tornado spin ups. The highest likelihood for that would again be just off to the west of Interstate 65. This is the future radar now. We're going to go forward in time through the early overnight. Watch what happens through the early evening hours. We are just fine. Mid to late evening, that starts to change, especially west of Louisville. By around 11 o'clock tonight, you can see the leading edge of the heavier showers and storms moving in from the west. It's at that time some of those could be producing some gusty winds and even that chance for an isolated tornado spin up. The farther east these things get, they're going to run out their support, so to speak. So I think they'll start to weaken as you go east of 65. Having said that, still at least a threat for some heavy rainfall. So once again, greatest threat for strong to severe storms later this evening will be from about Louisville, but especially west for gusty winds and even an isolated tornado spin up or two will be possible. All right, let's go to tomorrow now. You're going to wake up to a lot of clouds and good chances for scattered showers and a few rumbles of thunder. A very, very slow moving system. Even through the morning commute and mid morning hours, we're still wet. And then tomorrow afternoon, we start to improve. A little window of dry weather will sneak across the viewing area. And in doing so, those temperatures will warm back into the low 70s tomorrow afternoon. So actually, tomorrow afternoon, We'll see improvements, especially by mid to late day. Outside right now, middle to upper 70s. It's warm out there. The humidity 62%. A south breeze in here between 10 and 20 miles per hour. Here's your forecast. Turning unsettled, but not until later on. Breezy, mild showers and storms will advance into the western communities after uh, 8 or 9 o'clock tonight. 72 degrees at 10. The rain and storms advancing, likely impacting the metro after. 10 to 11 o'clock tonight, uh, again for Louisville, and uh, shortly thereafter for areas off to the east. We're 67 tomorrow morning with periods of showers, even a few rumbles of thunder. Still looks wet midday, and then we'll get a little pocket of dry weather in here tomorrow afternoon and warm to 73. Then, as this entire system kind of just closes off over the Ohio Valley and doesn't go anywhere, Rain chances move back in Wednesday, linger into Thursday with cool weather, 59 and 64. Vicky Rick, we finally get rid of the mess for Friday 
and just in time for the weekend as well. Hey. Near 70 uh, for your upcoming weekend and dry skies expected for a change. That is good. <laughs>